So we just connected the printer, turn power on, and then in the computer we see this okay, COM3. So we have to start our okay our software. We use this. I can use X printer also, and then this one I need to check to COM3, COM3, and then to check if it's connected, I try a cut paper. Okay, so it's done. It got connected. And first of all, we need to change the uh, setting of the advanced. Change it to USB printing. Okay. So after we change it to the USB printing, uh, we can use USB mode to log in for the next time. So first of all, I try change to USB. I try again to cut paper. Okay. So if we are... So if we have by default it will have the beeping after we didn't take the paper for some time like now okay so okay so how to how to close it we have a code okay the code is shared here okay so we take this one okay take this one then we go to the Okay, we go to this, then first of all we turn on the hex, then we... Okay, so now we will try to paste in the code. Okay, then we press the print button. Okay, so it's done. So if you want to try a test again, we can try to cut the paper. Okay, uh, if you... Okay, so now we see it, so we can proceed. If it will, if it's still having the beeping function, then it will. Okay, so wait. Okay, so sorry, just now I used the wrong code. So back to the code here. So this one is not correct. So for this one, it's a CPQ plus. So for CPQ plus, we have to use this one. Okay, so this one, copy. Okay, so again, go to, okay, go to this one, and then I paste in, okay, so this is the code, okay, you can try a cut paper again, it, it will, it will still connected, okay, seems still connected, then now I try to, okay, so after done, okay, I can try again to print, uh, to cut a paper. Okay, so if it still have the beeper, it will be, if no, it will be okay for now already. So I proceed to change the IP setting. Okay, 101 is one of it. Two, one. Okay. I think it's uh, 1 to 8 Okay, so that's all of it Done